Oh, you can hit that loot door, but when you're on my team, you can't hit it open. Are you serious? Are you serious? I'm getting subbed out here. Over under um 10 points down. Well, what's the over under on the differential when I get subbed out? Yeah, but if you went over, you're correct because we're down by 12 now. See what happens when you give me time to meld What? Oh my god, bro, I can't. I I don't understand it. I don't understand. I don't. I don't. Nope. How in the ever living hell? I'm not gonna get fouled here, am I? I'm not even gonna make it. You are kidding me, 2K. You are messing with me right now. I gotta give it to Lame Lamello. What are you doing, Lamello? Why would you pat? He hit that. You're telling me you can hit that shot, but anyone else on my team can't. You that better count. He didn't get off in time. I'm gonna kill myself. Anything's possible. A a anything's possible for the Suns. That should be good, bro. Thank you. Tie game. A O run. All right, what's going on, everybody? Welcome back to this my NBA career. And as you know, last episode we took a heartbreaking loss to the Los Angeles Lakers. As you can see from the first quarter and the third quarter, we just could not hang. And as you see by the box score, 56 points. For Cedric Lewis on good shooting. Shot 15 for 15 from the free throw line. But it was not enough. Because my second leading scorer was LaMelo Ball with only 12 points. As you can see, Jeremy Grant went 1 for 10 from the field. Kevin Love went 2 for 7 off the bench in 11 minutes. So, due to that, I made some... My last trade, as you know, I get 3 trades a season. Along with 3 free agency suggestions when we get to free agency. So I'm allowed to offer 3 players in free agency a contract. And for the upgrading, um, before we upgrade, I'm going to only allow myself to actually add attribute upgrades to Cedric at the end of every season. So usually I'll put in these stats, I'll get XP, and I will upgrade them on the spot and put into 2k. I decided... I am just going to upgrade them only in the offseason. The offseason is where I'm going to be allowed to use my XP points. And if you don't know, we are going to be using a program called Synergy 2K in order to upgrade Cedric Lewis. And you guys will see that in a second. And that player, as you can see, is DeAndre Ayton from the Phoenix Suns. And the only reason why I traded for DeAndre Ayton, first we needed a center badly because the games I play on my own, Mark Williams was getting killed on the boards. I mean... Okongu from the Hawks was murdering him on the rebounds. So I figured we needed someone like DeAndre Ayton. He was the perfect center and he was on the trade block. Yes, the Phoenix Suns had DeAndre Ayton on their trade block. I wish I recorded it next um, season. If I make trades, I'll make sure I do it in the video. But I just had to pull the trigger before something happened. I'll show you the package we got him for, but he is averaging 14 points, 10 rebounds in a block this season with 38% from three. I don't know on how many attempts. I really don't care. Okay, only on 37 attempts, but still, he has a decent three-point shot. He has a 73-pointer, which is a lot better than Mark Williams. He doesn't have the defense of Mark Williams, but he has better offense and better rebounding, which is all I need because I can't be out here getting 15 rebound games every, every time and my center only gains seven. And here is the trade. We sent Mark Williams, Lou Dort, Cody Martin, Kevin Love, and Gabe Vincent to the Suns for DeAndre Ayton, Landry Samet, and Fillers. And speaking of the Suns, that is a team we are going to be facing in this episode. This is what their new lineup looks like. It's Chris Paul, it's Devin Booker, and Kevin Durant. You already know. With Kevin Love sliding in at that power forward spot now with Mark Williams as the starting center. Mo Wagner off the bench, Lou Dort, Alec Burks. Darius Baisley and Gabe Vincent. This team looks a lot better. They are still only the 12th seed. They're only a game and a half out of the play-in, so I think they'll definitely turn things around. And now, with Center 2K open, we are going to put in our stats modifier. We're actually going to leave at the default, and we did not win except invalid modifier. Oh, input. Oh, never mind. It actually went through. Uh, I don't know how much XP we got. We are up to 25,000, so we got about 12,000 for that. And as you can see, game three, the stats are put in and before we hop into the game against the suns this will be the starting lineup for the rest of the season for the hornets as you can see we now have a weakness our starting small forward is terrence ross but we do have depth at the position we have kenny hustle we have yuda the shooter landry shamit georges niang if necessary i could slide over to the four position i mean the three position but terrence ross is gonna have to do for now let's go up against 
Kevin Durant and the Phoenix Suns. Here we are in the Suns house for our fourth game of the season. We're playing. It's obviously not the fourth game. I believe we are 22 and 18. I don't remember. I didn't really even check my record before this game, but I know we're the seventh seed. And we're fighting for a play-in spot. Lamel Ball is going to start off with a three and brick the living hell out of it. We're going to have to trust Terrence Ross guarding Kevin Durant. I don't like it, but I mean, if necessary, I'll put him on uh, Devin Booker. Kevin Love from downtown. Yeah, that's what we remember. Uh, if necessary, I'll put Terrence Ross on Devin Booker. But he immediately turns the ball over on his first offensive possession. Devin Booker. Drills to mid-range. Back to me. Back to me, LaMelo. For downtown. That Oh, that's a mid-range. I'll still take it. Cedric Lewis with his first shot of the game from the mid-range spot. Let's get DeAndre Ian involved. Against his former team, he's got to have a big game. Oh, no. Jeremy Grant in the corner. Please hit it. He does. Jeremy Grant. Starting off the game one for one. So, you already know he's about to miss his next five. Terry... Oh my god, how does how does that mismatch happen? How does Terry end up guarding Darius Baisley? Doesn't make sense to me. Kick it back to me, Terry. Terry, what what makes you think you're gonna make that? Next time I'll let you take it. Cause you're not making it. You you're just not. I'm taking that mid range. That should be a bucket. Thank you. This team is so ass. Gimme that. Gimme that. Nick Richards, keep cutting, please. Nick Richards, easy bucket, thank you. One point game. There's no reason we should be struggling against the Suns second unit, man. Oh, you can hit that loot door, but when you're on my team, you can't hit it open. Are you serious? Are you serious? Alec Burks now. Watch him somehow slither by me. No, but he nearly makes that shot. We're down by two, and we got outplayed by the Suns second unit. I'm getting subbed out here. Over, under, um, 10 points down. Well, what's the over, under? On the differential when I get subbed out. Yeah, but if you went over, you're correct because we're down by 12 now. Jeremy, please. Jesus Christ, dude. Thank you, Nick Richards, for actually being good at basketball. LaMelo, thank you. I, I seriously need to stop passing to Jeremy Grant. This dude doesn't hit any shots. He hits one a game and that's it. No, LaMelo, why do you always immediately take the shot? Please, just give me time to get open. I beg of you, Yuta, the shooter, please hit this. It's a brick, man. I can't catch a break. See what happens when you give me time, Lamelo. To... What? Oh my God, bro! I can't. I I don't understand it. I don't understand. I don't. I don't. Nope. Don't understand it. How in the ever live? Give me that. Give me that. How in the ever living? I'm not going to get fouled here, am I? I'm not even going to make it. You are kidding me, 2K. You are messing with me right now. I got to give it to Lame Lamello. What are you doing? Lamello! Why would you pat? He hit that. You're telling me you can hit that shot? But anyone else on my team can't. You, that better count. But from near the logo. He didn't get off in time. He didn't get off in time. I'm going to kill myself. This man, Kevin Love, now wants to hit shots. Now he's hitting shots. But when you were on my team, wide open, you can't hit him. That's what I don't understand. It's literally 2K against you. Thank you, Terry, for... I can't stand myself. I hate myself. I hate myself. I actually hate myself. How do I mess it up that bad? Aiden, get on your goddamn man. I'm not guarding the center. No, I'm not letting this happen. And then Dort's going to be left over for three because no one knows how to guard their own man. And now I'm getting subbed out. We're down by five, so you might as well chop it up to 15. Because as close as this game fell, it's not that close. Six points. Six points might be close in your eyes. But for this team, it's not. It feels like a 20-point lead. We need a stop here. I know there's eight and a half minutes left. But knowing this team and how ass our defense is... Guys don't know how to stay on their own man. And then Kevin Love setting huge screens like that where I can't get through. Anything's possible. A anything's possible for the Suns. That should be good, bro. Thank you. Tie game. 8-0 run. We desperately need to get a win. Jeremy Grant. Good job not fouling. Good job, Jeremy Grant not fouling. I'm going straight to the rack. I'm going straight to the rack. That's Kevin Love. No foul. DeAndre Ayton, huge rebound. No foul. I am, I've am. i gone to the line once. 
Jeremy, keep cutting, please. I don't trust you. I just, I just don't. I don't trust him. I think he's going to take a contested shot. Aiton, I need you to cut now. Thank you, DeAndre. And extends the lead to two possessions. 14-0 run in the last three minutes. Chris Paul with the screen. Come on, Jeremy. Good switch. Good switch. I'm there. Jeremy Grant with the block. Come on, Jeremy. Give it to me. Give it to me. Aiton, keep cutting. Aiton, keep cutting. DeAndre Aiton. Oh, he gets fouled. I got to go to the hot hand. The hot hand is DeAndre Aiton. I got to go to the hot hand. DeAndre Ayton, give me that triple-double. Extends the lead back to eight. He's got 22 points against his former team. you love to see it. Down the court, Jeremy Grant. Great outlet pass. That's easy. 10-point lead. Uh, Devin Booker's four for 18. And we have a double-digit lead for the first time against a good team. Can we keep it? I feel confident. Devin Booker in the corner. It's off. Oh, I'm out. Outlet. 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 That should, that's it. That's it. We. There's no way we blow this lead. Five and a half minutes left. I know that's a lot. But with the momentum we have, D Durant and Booker are tired. Booker's cold. We can't blow this lead, man. Terrence Ross just got his ankle snapped. And this will be the final possession. We pull out with the victory. The first one of the series. And it's a double-digit one against Kevin Durant and the Phoenix Suns. DeAndre and shows that he don't need him. Domelo Ball, he's not going to shoot. Oh, no, he shot it. He shot it way too late. He should have shot it when I uh, told you to. But we're going to win here on Phoenix's home court. DeAndre Ayton gets his revenge. Final box score. Terrence Ross did a damn good job on Kevin Durant. Only 18 points, 9 rebounds, 3 assists, 7 for 18 from the field. And, of course, what, what else would happen? Kevin Love all of a sudden becomes prime K-Love. 17 points, 5 for 7 shooting from 3. Where was this on our team? That it that's 2K. That's literally 2K for you. That's the greatest example of it. Chris Paul got clamped. Lou Dort had a good game. Once again, where was this when you were on our team? I had Devin Booker in hell. I had four for 21, two for eight. This man couldn't do anything. Mark Williams had eight points, ten rebounds, four assists, but with four turnovers. For the Hornets, a mean triple double. For Cedric Lewis, 35 points, 11 rebounds, 12 assists, and 5 steals. Only 2 turnovers on the day. Didn't shoot great from the field, mainly because of that first half. I just could not find my shot. But I would have been 10 for 16 if I didn't attempt any threes. And Aiton, what a game. 22 points, 14 rebounds on 10 for 14 shooting. That's what we needed from a big man on this team. 14 big rebounds. Uh, Lamella Ball at 15, 4, and 8. Really good game from him. Rozier gave us 10 off the bench. Nick Richards has been an amazing player for this team. Grant still sucks. Just leave it at that. But that's going to be for me. Leave a like I did enjoy. Subscribe, guys. Are new. GG.